And what you're looking at is a 1963 Chevrolet Impala station wagon. This thing is a beast. It's huge. We did do a paint protection on this, a ceramic coat. Now, the paint is not perfect on this car, but the owner did not want perfect because the clear coat is very thin. And if we got too aggressive with the paint, it would have went right through the clear coat. So the purpose of this was a paint enhancement and a preservation of the paint that was on the car while he does some suspension work and, and some other stuff to it. Now, I've had some people ask me what products did I use to, uh, to do this car with, so uh, let me show you now. Luckily, the car was clean when the owner brought it to me, so all we had to use was a, a wristless wash and a Marilax Axle 3000 foamer. You just spray it on the car in such a manner, and then you go by and wipe it off with a microfiber towel. We then went over the car with a clay towel with the mother's detail spray, so we got all the body contaminants off the car. Then we went over it with an Eagle One black and plastic coat, which this stuff is actually an iron remover. After all that was done, we broke out a Griot's Garage 15 millimeter, five inch oral buffer and a Griot's Garage three inch oral buffer, both with orange medium cutting pads. And we teamed that up with a Sonax Perfect Finish. And if you can see right there, the cut is a four and the gloss is a five. Once that was done, we did have to go over the car. Oh, we had to go over the car with a grease and wax remover. So what we used, was a Rust-Oleum wax and tar remover. As you can see right here, it says removes wax, grease, road film, all that stuff. What this does, it gets any of the leftover residues from whatever wax may have been left on the car, whatever uh, residue that the perfect polish went on. Then we topped the car with the ceramic coat. This is a Dallas Paint Correction Luxury Microfiber Shield Pro Ceramic Coat. One coat on the car is good for two years, two coats on the car for three years if you properly maintain it. So we put this on the car, we allowed it to dry for, it's supposed to dry for 24, we allowed 48 hours of dry time. Then we went back over it with a top coat from Dallas Paint Correction Luxury Microfiber and the Kingsguard. Now this top coat will last about six months, but I've asked the owner to bring the car back to me in three. We'll put another top coat on it again. So those are all the things that we use to do a paint preservation on this 1963 Chevy Impala. It is an absolute beautiful car. Every piece of trim, chrome, and everything is on this car. Stunning. I know this is a short little film, but I spent, a lot, I spent the whole week working on this thing. So anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please like, share, comment. Please hit that subscribe button down there for me. I'd really appreciate it. As always, hang loose, keep the shiny side up. Thanks.